all right guys welcome back to else hustle today's video is all about linking a visa debit card to paypal now how to link a visa or a debit card to paypal and then we are going to do this right in ghana here you can follow me on instagram at l underscore jones 1960 for any questions so don't forget to subscribe to the channel now linking a visa or debit card to paypal what you need to learn now in this video you're going to learn how to link your visa debit card to paypal tips on linking your visa debit card to paypal and then which country does paypal allow visa card linking and then withdrawal now the requirements you need is a it's a visa debit card or a visa card from a local bank such as uba or standard chartered bank I have a video on how to create a standard chartered bank you can go and check it out now this is my paypal balance and then you can see that in my accounts i have 9.12 usd so when you click on transfer money it gives you the option to transfer your money into a card i have linked a card right here and then you can see um my card right right here and then tra it transfers the money within one to three days you also have the option to link a bank account which i wouldn't you know go through in this video because we are linking the debit card so when you head on to payments you can also have the option to link a card in your business paypal account now these are countries and regions um that paypal um linking of cards are available for withdrawal now you have to go to one of these if you want to create your business account in a country where PayPal is not allowed. So let's say, for instance, you create an account in Kenya. When you link a card, you'll not be able to transfer the pound to the card because Kenya only deals with a bank called Equity Bank. Right. So I created this my PayPal account in the UAE and I chose Dubai and they allowed direct linking um, of your Visa card and then you transfer the money into your visa card right. so in settings when you go to account settings we then head on to money banks and cards You have the option to also link a card right from here if you do not see linking a card on the payment option on the payment tab you have to go to settings account settings and money banks and card to also link a card so if you do not find link a card on your summary interface or in the payment this is what you have to do you can see this is my card and i've linked it so i'm going to go to step by step tutorial on how i link this card now in other accounts too you can also see wallet you wouldn't you wouldn't see any payment option so you would have to see wallet and then you you can link a card when you click on wallet or you see link a card right on the interface so when you head on to wallet you can see that you have the option to link a card so back to our original account so back to our original account we are going to go to we are going to go to settings and then account settings and then we head on to money banks and card now we click on link a card and we will try to link a new visa card to um our paypal account and this visa card is it's a it's a standard chartered visa card i said earlier that you can use a standard chartered visa card or a uba bank visa card so watch the video to the end if you like what i'm doing on this channel you can just you know click the like and subscribe so when you want to link a card this is the interface you see and then you have to input the your card number right here and then you select the card type expiry date and then the security code and this is my billing address at the, at the bottom right there so it is not quite difficult you have to link your card 
and then this is my expiry date so my card will expire in 2026 now the security code which is the csc code you can find it at the back of your card so once you fill in this um, or, um this form you just click on link card and then you see paypal tells you you link your visa debit with the card and my card is ending with p410 so with this you have to click on done and then a gmail will be sent to your uh, will be sent to the um the gmail you use in creating the bank account so i'll click on done right here and then move to my gmail and you can see i have an email saying that ghana 6.12 cd transaction was made on card ending with 3410 at paypal so you come here and then so the next step is to confirm your card so we're going to click on confirm card and then we're going to move on with the tutorial so once you click you'll be brought to an interface like this and you have to give your card a nickname so i have to give you a nickname which is my name so I have, I'm, I'm typing in L and then once I'm done I click on save and then move on to the next step. Now we have the confirm um, your card option which is blue in the box so here you can see it here. I'll have to click on this one and then it says that once I click on it it says that looking for a small charge on your card after you request the code you'll be charged 1.95 dollars to your card and this usually appears within five to seven business days after you confirm it paypal will automatically refund your money back to you so you, you need to make sure that you have money in your account and then yes so you log into paypal once you receive this code and the code will be in the form pp and your number four digits number and then the code at the end so your code will be between the pp and then the code right so you click on get code and then paper will then send you another gmail and then it says a code is on its way it should appear on your card statement within five to seven business days right so your next step which is the third one in linking your account is to enter your code into paper so let's go back to the gmail and then you then look for the code and then enter it into paper so let's look for the code right here right so this is the code and then it says ghana 11.94 series transaction was made on your card ending with 3410 at pp i said earlier pp the code is a four digit code is the one i've highlighted in blue so you have to copy this code and then go back to paypal enter the code to confirm and then yes yeah, so i'll paste the code right here and then let's wait for the magic to happen right so keep in mind that the code should be between the pp and the code right sorry the four digits should be in the pp and the code right so we click on confirm And if you do this and you don't get a new code, you can request for a new code. So we click on confirm, and then it says your L debit, and then your your account number, the four, the last four ending digits has been confirmed. So you have successfully linked a card to PayPal. It's quite simple. It's a standard chartered card. You can watch my video on how to create a standard chartered bank account. Right. So these are the details. You can add more if you want. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Like and share the video to your friends. Else hustle. Thank you. See you in my next video. Peace.